greatest filmmaker of all time. Just think of what he's meant. You know, the fact that there's another Star Wars coming out this month, and it's 40 years later, and the effect that he has on America. And Rita Moreno is, is a phenomenal talent, change Broadway, and Carol King, one of the great songstresses of all time. And, uh, you know, it, it's it's really a great group. You know? I, so we're happy to be here. I love it. And Julie Chan, I'd love to have you come over here as well. You were actually, hi, WUSA 9, Great Day Washington. You were actually on our show um, for the season premiere of The Talk. Oh. And now you're yes, here yes, in yes, Washington. Yes, yes, yes. yes, with Cheryl Underwood. Tell me about who you're most excited to see to be honored tonight. Well, because I know Rita Moreno personally, um, I've admired her as everyone else has in this country and around the world for years since her performance in West Side Story. But over the years, thankfully because I'm an interviewer, I have become friendly with her and I really tip my hat off to Rita. 84 and no signs of slowing down, nor should she. Um, also Carol King. I mean, think about all the songs that she has contributed to um, American music history. We are still singing and enjoying her music today. It, it had, and I think forever we will. Okay, well, thank you so much. Can I get a quick selfie with you all? Sure. Yay, Absolutely. okay. Absolutely. Well, I'm not very good at it, and you, you guys look so great, but here we go. One, two, three. Thank you, good. guys. Thank nice you. to meet you. Enjoy the evening. Hey, I'm Jason I'm Fraley with WTOP in town. Oh. Hey, right. <laughs> could you guys take me to the first time? To go back to the theater when you saw Star Wars for the first time. Do you remember sitting there? I absolutely remember sitting there, and uh, you know it was phenomenal. There was nothing like it that ever existed. And as I said, they're still talking about it today, 40 years later. And the mythology, I mean, it's brilliant. It's hard to imagine thinking up that world, but George Lucas yeah. did. And do you remember the first Carol King song you listened to? Oh, I was going to tell you about my Star Wars experience. Oh, let's hear it. Yeah, let's hear it. My first Star Wars experience was an event. My cousins drove down from Poughkeepsie. We all had lunch at my house in Queens, and we drove to the RKO Theater in Flushing. And I remember my young cousin getting dressed in a button-down collared shirt for this, <laughs> for a movie. Um, and then it changed the world. He co-created Raiders, too. Do you remember seeing Indiana Jones the I first do. Time? I remember that first one was very scary at the end when they <laughs> lifted that tomb and the ghosts. That Face was, melting. Um, <laughs> still scary today. All right, guys. Thank enjoy. How important is the